found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, the guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Why don't we eat first and then go inside here? Are we gonna unscrew it or something? Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, <laughs> you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? No. Guess we could ask him. What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. You know? We'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Kenny said he heard a noise behind there, though. I mean, tools don't make a noise. Andy's already at the bar, and you know? You know, just leave. Huh. Guess not then. Is there something over here? More stalls. Nothing going on in here. I have a feeling like something's going to be hidden in one of these. What's going on in here? Some kind of way. I had to find a way to distract them to get them outside, right? Oh, what's this? Wheelbarrow. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. How very strange. Um, so I have to go distract him or something? Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. I need something to get the screws off with though as well, I don't know. I'm not going to use my axe or a camera. Is there tools kicking about somewhere? <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage it just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Oh, everyone seems like they're getting on quite well here. Uh, there's nothing over there, was there? Let's actually, while we're here, let's go find out what these guys were arguing about. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? Kenny thinks they're hiding something. I'm not sure what exactly, but we're starting to get a feeling about this place. I don't know. Maybe yeah, we it's should quite go suspicious, have a look like. at that barn. Whatever you do, just be careful. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. 
he comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Yeah, another dad's not here. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Does he treat you like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just, he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself and me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. You say he's not a bad guy though, but he punched me and left me for dead with a zombie, so... Sounds like a pretty bad guy to me. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Thanks. Is there anything over here we didn't spot the last time? Maybe some tools? Nope, no tools. Need a screwdriver or something to get these screws off with. Still not been up into the house yet. Although, don't know if I can just... Oh, there's tools. Let's go get them. There's a lucky spot. Toolbox. Uh, Leatherman. Multi-tool, whatever it's called. That'll have Let's a screwdriver thing on it. So how do we distract them then? We're gonna like... Do something with the generator maybe? Can we like turn it off temporarily, then run inside? Yeah, yeah, let's go for that. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. He's gone back inside, hasn't he? So how am I supposed to turn that off and walk past them? Get Kenny to do it, maybe? Let's go see if we can get Kenny to do it. Or at least give him the screwdriver first. And then we can go and do it. One of those two. Up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Go distract them. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Dude, I found the thing. The thing with the thing. So much darker in there. It's like night and day. Anyway, let's go try this. Maybe there's something else I need to to do with it, make him stay out here a bit longer. I'm glad Andy knows how to fix this if something goes wrong. I'm clueless about this stuff. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Something else we can do apart from just flicking the switch. Oh, we can take this off. Okay, something we can do in here that'll delay him a bit longer, maybe. There you go. How are we gonna take that off? Looks like that dumpster in the uh, what you call it. 
<laughs> okay, turn off first and then take the belt off. Yeah, that works. <coughs> that thing is on too tight for my bare hands. Oh, that's fine. We've got this thing. There, cool. that should do it. Oops. Through a bill. Damn it. Oh, oh, son of a. Oh, oh, this take forever. Yes, he's distracted now. We can go back inside. There, he slowly walk back inside. Oh. Let's get this door open. Better not be some kind of like zombie cow in here or something. I'm not gonna get eaten. I hope. I don't have anything to defend myself with. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Okay, let's do this. Don't just let the screws fall on the floor, though. I'm gonna lose them. Need to keep these zombie cows out. Dun dun dun! Whoa! Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Uh -oh. Dinner time. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. <laughs> he seemed to react to that quite well. <laughs> Strangely, you are an angel. Excuse a mess. We had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry, that was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mom? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. <laughs> yes, ma'am. We're in here. How is that her this husband? Must be Terry. In this room. Yeah, in this room. Here we go. Let's <laughs> just like take a look at her Some drugs. Kind of lotion. <laughs> could use a shave. What's this? Gauze pads. Hmm. Very interesting. Not. So, well, I'm not washing my hands. What's the deal with this? Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Some kind of power cable going in there or something. Um, I guess we're going upstairs then. <laughs> Something very suspicious going on here, that's for sure. Go 
in there. In here. Wait, that's where the power cable is. Let's go check that out first. It's probably just for the generator though. <laughs> where is that cord going? Oh, it's broken off. Case or something. Like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Probably Mark. Oh no, Mark wasn't. Oh yeah, he was injured, wasn't he? He got an arrow shot. Musty as hell. Candles. Smart. Morphine. What do they need so much morphine for? Probably for all the guys to get shot with arrows. You not close the cupboard? No, I guess not. Let's go in here then. I feel kind of bad sneaking about in our house like this though. It's a bit weird. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Yeah. Let's see, Feels done like a runner. A storm coming. Guess not. What is going on in that picture? <laughs> what is actually going on in that picture? That woman looks like she's squirting milk onto a guy. <laughs> How very strange. Is that blood? Let me go look at this a bit closer. Oh, I can't look at it closer. Some kind of dodgy picture going on there, anyway. Farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. There's light coming from under there, though. They're hiding something. that mark Lee. Mark. What holy crap <sighs> brothers what the hell happened to your legs uh, man don't eat dinner <laughs> oh you're kidding me They're eating Mark. Are they eating Mark? I feel like quite bad leaving him up there with no legs, but whatever. Don't eat that! Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had to stop. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Okay. I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade us meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Britta. Tell me he's not being eaten right now. It's true. Everything Holy could've crap. turned out okay for you folks. He would've died anyway. We gotta think about living. He would've that died anyway. Down. He only got shot with an arrow. Growing up in rural Georgia. In his shoulder. Not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Imply? Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. 
like y'all. Whoa, what you said? Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! Holy crap. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? You fucking black Put your fuck. guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. Lee? Lee? Hey, leave her alone. Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Um, is that Mark? Oh, is he turned into? Oh, he's not. Not just yet. Ew. She Bastard. hates them. Open this door, God damn it! I will knock the really goddamn God door stuff. down! It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee! We gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Let us out, you sons of bitches. Dad! This goddamn dumb sucker here, though, was the right? one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. God, you worse than the walker. Dad, We're please. not all in here. Where's... Gotcha. I'll rip your goddamn heads off. And make you swallow them. And duck. Come on, they got them somewhere else for some yeah. reason. <laughs> what was Kenny doing? Oh, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get. Uh, oh man, Easy. again. Is he dead? Dad! Oh god, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead! It has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard in the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Billy, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Morning and later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's Holy not crap. dead! We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size! Yeah, that was hard, to be fair. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Got to destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You've got to have my back this time. Okay, Kenny. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Uh... Come on. Sorry, but I think Wake he's up. a goner. You're right, Kitty. Let's get this you over. fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see. I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! The only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! No! Oh, man. No, no, no! Harsh. Oh, he's gonna drop one of those things on no! his head. 